Um, hey, before we get into the Q and A, I was kind of hoping to show you this. Uh oh. Uh, so uh, believe it or not, let's see. Actually, Greg, would you like to go over there and and hold and perhaps play this so that I can do a, a close up? It's About funny, six it looks months orange, ago, but it's actually red. Yeah, it's bright red. About six months ago, I posted something on Facebook to the official Rock Smith page. Uh, saying that we had found these plans for a 3D printed guitar. Uh, what did people think about it? And the reaction was very strong. Like people were all for, <laughs> all for it or all, or all against it. And I just, being a nerd, I was like, I really want to see what a 3D printed guitar looks and feels and plays like. So uh, my friend Eugene, hi Eugene, if you're watching, he's a Rocksmith player. Uh, I put out a call on my personal Facebook page, and a friend of a friend hooked me up with Eugene, said he's got a 3D printer, and he's a guitarist, and he'd probably get a kick out of this. Mm -hmm. So over uh, the course of a, you know, a couple weekends for him, uh, he printed it out. He actually did two versions. Uh, the first one did not work out, it turns out. Mm -hmm. uh, but this one did. It's six pieces. It's, there's no struts or supports or anything in it. Uh, and it's uh, it's a fully playable, if somewhat dinky. No, I hear. Uh, oh yeah, all right. Which Greg can actually make it uh, go very nice. The neck is three pieces: the headstock and then two pieces of the neck. <laughs> Considering that this is about eighty bucks worth of plastic. It is definitely a science experiment, but holy cow, look at what he's doing on this thing. <laughs> so everything, that's very good, Greg. Everything on this guitar is, is, is on a 3D printer. It's pretty fun. Uh, the body is three pieces, and the neck, like I said, is three pieces. So it's six pieces just glued together. Uh, I bought $10 cheapy electric tuners on Amazon and $5 nylon strings. So this was, you know... It's an experiment. I'm not going to say, well, throw away your Les Paul. But <laughs> I was just curious to see. What, and, you, and that was kind of the reaction on Facebook is, why would anybody bother to do a little crappy idea? This is not the future of instruments. I'm like, but the future is I don't have a thing, and I made it out of plastic in my home. Like, that was what I found really interesting about it. So a uh, fun toy that I'll probably keep in the office for a little while. Mm -hmm. um, but Greg has actually proven that if you know what you're doing, yeah. you can make it. The action is sky high. It's like drive oh, yeah. a bridge, you know, drive a truck under that bridge kind of. Uh, it's good for slide. Yeah, <laughs> slide, nylon, slide string. nylon string. That's guitar. the future, kids. <laughs> that's, that's a, you I like how we're becoming the studio of uh, tiny guitars. Yes, the U-Bass <laughs> now has a like friend to play with.